Hello friends, welcome back. I am Trilochan. Let's continue with Python series. In the previous tutorial, we had discussed how to sum elements of two lists in Python. In this tutorial, we will discuss global variables, local variables, and non-local variables, and where to use them in Python. This is very important to understand the scope of the variable while we are writing a code. Okay, though this is very easy, yet need to understand the concept so that we can access and define the variable as for our use cases. So let's start with the global variable. Global variable, like global terms itself, telling us it should be accessible anywhere. In Python, a variable declared outside of the function or in global scope is known as global variable. This means that a global variable can be accessed inside or outside of the function. Let's take an example of global variable. How to create that? So let's first uh, you can define x equals to suppose 10 and let's define another function where you can give any name here true yes so here let me print it okay so inside the function so print inside okay x here again you can call the function here and again print that one and so copy and paste here it is so here you can write outside of this function okay so let's execute it so for executing the python you can write python 3 and that python file name right so here it is so let's save and execute it yes so inside the x of x, value of x is inside 10 and outside also is 10 so the definition of global variable as i discussed as we, i said a variable declared outside of the function or in global scope is known as global variable right this means that a global variable can be accessed inside or outside of the function. That means here, inside of the function and outside of the function, we can access the same variable. So let's try to change this variable. Some, let's uh, do some uh, operation here. X plus two. So let's execute this and see the result here. So how how it is? Is it working or not? So I. I am sure it is a error. So local variable x reference before assignment. We have to assign this. So we have a solution to access the global variable and change the value. So here you can write the keyword global x. Okay. So now see the magic. You can execute the same and the result will be 12. Here the variable of like global variable is changed everywhere the x value of x is now 12 because it's 10 plus 2 okay so let's see how the local variable we can execute so here you can define y okay so let me here the value of x value of x is you can write inside x here it is out you can write outside x so let me print one more statement print statement here with y so here it is y and this is y and here we can also print the same statement with y so let's see let's execute and see the result so here y is equal to x plus 2 and x value is 10 and y should be here 12 and let's see here why it is given an error because I will say here name y is not defined that means this is defined within the function so it it is a local variable to that function okay 
so this is local variable and global variable so let's execute again with comment y here it is inside x is 10 inside y is equal to 12 and outside x is 10 again okay so this is how you can check global variable and the local variable so global global variable means it is inside it can be accessed inside the function and outside of the function and local variable is only accessible in within the function okay so this is here you can check y is in a local variable okay so this is this is why we cannot access the outside of the function here okay so this is local and the global variable and last variable is we will discuss non-local variable let's understand the non-local variables non-local variables are used in nested function here it is you can see i have written already a function within the function foo1 i have written another function okay so this is nested functions whose local scope is not defined whose local, local scope is not defined this means that the variable can be neither in the local nor the global scope so here it is let's execute this and see the example here so here x is equal to 10 which is in global you can say okay so within uh, for this foo function this is a global variable right and x is equal to 15 here which is local to the foo function right so inside of x it should be 15 and outside of this foo function and this should be what 15 sorry 10 so let's execute and see the result so let me execute it so inside also x and here outside also it is 15 okay so let me uh, edit here let's execute again here you can see inside x is equal to 15 here it is value of x is 15 outside also 15 so it means it is neither on local scope or in global scope okay so only changes happen in local like if we change the value of non-local variable the changes appear in the local variable that means x is equal to 15 okay this is all about global local and non-local variables in python so i hope you like this video please do like share comment subscribe and thank you so much for watching